Welcome back everyone. This is Carrie from Finding Value. I'm doing my 30 bags in 30 days decluttering challenge and I'm outside again. I'm decluttering an outdoor space. Yours doesn't have to be an outdoor space today, but if you are looking for some inspiration, what I suggest is to find something in your home that you can try to sell. I know some of you probably love selling things at a consignment shop or a Facebook marketplace, and we really do too. We have been putting a lot of things on Facebook marketplace lately, and I actually think it's a really wonderful way to earn a little bit of cash for those items that otherwise you may have just held on to, but you're a little bit motivated to get them out of your home because it will benefit you slightly with getting a little bit of money. So. That is what we decided to do today. Actually, I should say we didn't earn any money on these. You can also put free things on Facebook Marketplace if you just want them out of your home. And so we were working on decluttering the hill that I showed you yesterday in the videos. We really want this space all cleared out. And my husband burned wood all day yesterday, made a pretty good dent. But we decided, why are we trying to burn all of this? There are some actual usable boards here. So we decided to put a few things on Facebook Marketplace for free in hopes that we could get rid of them right away. And three out of the four items already have been picked up. I feel like that is a huge success. We are very excited that these things are now off of our property and somebody else had a use for them. So I'll show you what these items were. We had some plywood. Three pieces are shown here. We actually found another one. So we got rid of four large and medium sized pieces of plywood that somebody will be able to use for their project. And we do not have to cut them up and try to burn them. That is such a wonderful thing. We also put this door onto Facebook Marketplace. This was a long shot. We knew it was kind of rotting. It's very, very heavy, but I didn't know if somebody at a farm or somewhere where they didn't really care what it looked like um, might try to have a use for it. It used to be our shed doors, but we don't have a use for them anymore and wanted to see if somebody else had a use for them. These have not been picked up. Thirdly, we had a pallet with some pallet boards that came with some lumber that we got and we thought maybe somebody can use these. We don't need to burn them if somebody has a use for them. These were picked up the very next day. Lastly, we got rid of this landscape edging. We've done a lot of edging projects in our yard the last few years. These were some mismatched and extra pieces that we no longer needed and somebody picked these up for their yard. Again, we didn't ask for any money for any of these items, but we are just ecstatic that they are being used, that they're out of our yard, and that we didn't have to manage them, cut them up, burn them, throw them away. So if you can think of some item that is in your home, you don't need to judge if somebody will want it or not. Some of these things we really didn't know if somebody would want. You just put them on Facebook Marketplace with as many details and good pictures as you can, and people will start messaging you. I do think that I want to put one little disclaimer out there. Be safe. Do things in the safest way that you can. And also, if you are just on a roll at donating things, getting them out of your house immediately, probably stick to that. If you don't need the money, if you're not having a problem deciding to get rid of things, and you don't really need that extra motivation of earning a little cash to decide to get rid of it, your best bet is to just donate. But if you need that little motivation, you need that little push, or you need someone to just come take it from you, you can't deliver it somewhere because it's large, that can be a good option for Facebook Marketplace. Thanks so much for watching this series, everyone. I hope that you'll come back and check out my video for tomorrow. God bless.